What's going on everybody? I'm Coach Gary. How are you guys doing today? Today's video is going to be about a new piece of equipment. So new gear, if you will, that we're going to be using for our upcoming football season. This is the Vengeance A11 football helmet by Shut. Today we're going to go over some of the special features, um, but I want to stop short of calling this a review because I want to get a year under our hats before I do a review. This was the helmet we just finished using. It's run its 10 year stint. This was the Recruit Hybrid by Shut. Uh, and we got good production out of this, uh, this old girl, but it's time for her to retire. All right. So I'm going to be using this as a comparison to some of the new features that we have in this A11. So thank you guys for joining me and um, let's get into the A11. The Vengeance A11 is a very handsome looking helmet. They call this one a low profile. I really like the dual shaped shell they have on this one. It's a lot more pronounced than the hybrid was. The ear hole design is a nice touch and the face mask is not too thick and not too thin. Very good looking helmet. Some of the special features on this helmet are the face mask brace right here. I think it's going to cut down on the time it takes to change out face masks because um, all you have to do is take these two clips off of the helmet. And then instead of having to take this off, all you have to do is twist this face mask and it'll come off. On the inside of the A11, Shut has designed what they call a TPU cushioning system. TPU stands for thermoplastic urethane and it's actually made up of two components. First of all, you have the inner liner. There's also a part of the inner liner that's here, but it's connected to the inside of the actual TPU system. But then the second component I was talking about was the actual TPU system itself. Again, it stands for thermoplastic urethane. And as you can see, it is located around the inside of the helmet, also underneath this pad here. Now, from the information I got from the website, and I'll leave a link in the description, the TPU system does three things for the helmet. Number one, it absorbs contact better and distributes it in a wider area around the helmet. It's supposed to create a better heat management system for the helmet, and it's supposed to keep the helmet more hygienic or cleaner. These are the non-inflatable inner liners, right? And as you can see, uh, some of the padding is a little thicker in different areas. This padding goes at the back of the helmet and this goes at the side of the helmet and you can see that's a little thicker all right and this actually goes at the top of the helmet This whole cushioning system is connected inside the helmet by Velcro. In the A11, the jaw pad system is redesigned. They call it an interlock jaw pad system. And to take this apart, all you have to do is pull this off. As you can see, that is Velcro. And this part is mechanically fastened to the helmet right there. So this part never comes out. And all you have to do is replace the pad. Just like that. And you're ready to go. Each new helmet comes with a leather chin strap. And because of the new extended design of the face mask, chin strap hookup is a breeze.
And that's the Vengeance A11 Youth Football Helmet by Shut. Like I said before, it is a very good looking helmet from front to back. Personally, I'm a think pad helmet type of guy. So I'm very interested on the feedback we're gonna get from our players at the end of the season. I can't wait to do a postseason review. That's my time, ladies and gentlemen. Thank you guys for watching and I hope you learned something. I'm Coach Gary, see you guys next time. Now the inside of the TPU, now the inside of the A11 is made up of what they call. Now on the inside of the A11, they have a system they call the TPU cushioning system. TPU stands for thermoplastic, thermoplastic urethane. Now on the inside of the T, now on the, on the inside of, on the inside of the A11, they have what is called a TPU cushioning system. The first thing I want to show you is um, the liners, the uninflatable, you have the uninflatable liners, the not, okay. In the hybrid hab, in the hybrid hat, in the hybrid helmet, now in our old helmet, in our, our in our old helmet, the, now in our old helmet, that's this one right here, the, to begin with, to begin with, let's just look at the overall profile of this helmet. And that's the A11, and that's the Vengeance A11 football helmet by Shut. And I hope you learned something. I'm Coach Gary. See you guys next time.